Hey guys, it's me and I am filming in a different location. Hopefully the lighting is better. Hopefully, um, whatever. I'm upstairs in my guest restroom right now and you're going to hear a lot of this because this is the shower curtain and this is my ponytail rubbing against it. So it's like, just ignore that. Um, I'm probably just going to try to lean forward and mess with it. So... We'll see how this goes. Tell me if you like it. Tell me if you're, you're just so used to me sitting on my ottoman um, talking to you or whatever you want to tell me, okay? Um, so today I went to Walgreens, <laughs> really just to go to Walgreens. I wasn't planning on buying anything, but the girl at the counter convinced me to buy mascara because she just did. I mean, she was really good at selling this stuff. And then she, like, added on a $2 coupon. And next thing you know, I'm buying mascara, a coral blush that I probably don't need, and then some eyeliner. And when I didn't really, because my husband was really going to Walgreens to go get something for him. And I wasn't, I was just there to go with him. The next thing you know, I'm spending, like, $30 in makeup. <sighs> How'd that happen? So I wanted to show you guys what I got and um, yeah so first thing is what the girl convinced me to buy was um, the week that I bought this it was um, CoverGirl was having like a buy one get one 50% off with the Nature Lux mascara and like the shadow blast thing she got me to try the shadow blast she actually had like testers which is really neat and she actually had like um, one of these tubes the nature lux um out so I, I you know obviously i'm not gonna put it on my eye that's kind of scary but i did look at the wand more closely and it was pretty neat um so i got the i got i always use waterproof and i got the nature lux in very black and I got it in black and brown they're both in waterproof and I don't know if you can see this but this is what the wand looks like it's you know the typical uh, plasticky rubbery wand but it looks like it would coat your eyelashes pretty well she was wearing it I mean the girl was really advertising it she was wearing like the the shadow blast with the, you know, the one with the primer in it, and I have tested it, I just washed it, but I haven't washed it off, but I'll just say this, from what I, I didn't buy any, but when I swatched two colors, they were okay, um, what really impressed me about those two were, was the fact that I went and ate and did some other stuff, and not until I, like, had to wash my hands that it would wash off, like, it didn't budge, it didn't go anywhere, so that was pretty nice. Um, I don't know how well it would work on, like, say, an, if you have oily skin or not, because I do have oily skin and, you know, oil slides down and everything. So, I, I don't know how that would work, but, um, I got these two, like I said, but it was buy one and get one half off, and then she also had a $2 coupon for me, so I think I bought these two for, I don't know, $13 for both of them. Excuse me, so that's not bad. But maybe it is because I didn't plan on buying anything. Then I asked her about Milani. Um, I wonder if they ever have sales on Milani. And she told me they never have sales on Milani, so I don't know what I was waiting for. Or what was I don't know what I was holding out for. So I finally broke down and I bought the Liquify eyeliner in black. You know raving about the, you know people have been raving about these colors and they also have like a lot of not as much as like urban decay but there are like you know like aqua blue and purple and stuff like in colors like that now too just not just the black now and i thought i saw a gold one too so there's a lot more options um you know it just in case you want to save some money or want to make a quick run out to Walgreens because you know it's not like you could just run out to like a Sephora or an Ulta to buy like the 24 7 um, pencil from Urban Decay and, you know this is only like seven dollars I think and um, 
Is it seven dollars? It was it was six fifty, and I think the twenty four seven one was like twenty something dollars. And then I got a baked blush. Um, looks like this. I don't know if we're gonna. I can't stand these things. It has a mirror and a little brush. I'll just leave it there. And this is the blush itself. I think it's like kind of washed out on the camera. But anyway, it's in Coralina. I don't know if you're gonna see that. And it's really nice. What I don't like about it is it's really sparkly, like really, really sparkly. But it is such a nice color, especially if you're like tan. There's a swatch of it right there. I don't know if you're gonna, I don't think you can see it. But it's really, really nice coral. It's really sparkly though, like fine shimmers in there. So if you don't want to look all shiny, you might want to avoid that. But, you know, whatever. And um, at my Walgreens, they were clearancing out, um, this is from a previous purchase, the Colorstay Mineral Finish Powders. And this is a highlighter in, I guess, Brighton, 10 Brighton. It looks like this, it's marbleized. And this is like bomb. Like, if you can get your hands on this, I know that they're clearancing this out, so I don't know. And I bought this a couple, a few weeks ago, so I'm not sure if they still have it, but if your Walgreens has it, it's like 75% off. I think I bought this up here like $3. It is like the most bomb highlighter I ever used. I, I don't use that many highlighters, but it's so nice. Like, let me, like, right there. I don't know if you can see that. But, oh, I love it. It is, it is bomb. And, like, look how big it is. I don't know how, like, how, if I'll ever finish this. But, because I don't highlight every day. And I don't, I'm lazy. Haven't really been wearing makeup a lot. So, yeah. Then... I did my favorite thing, which was go to the thrift store. Oh my gosh, I know I promised you guys that I would be doing like a, a fashion thing, but right now I'm a little tired. But I promise, I promise in the next few videos, I will actually put it on and like show you. Oh, but before that, let me just show you the shirt that I'm wearing right now. It is hilarious. All I gotta say, all I'm gonna do is just show you and tell you what it says and you can figure it out. You can say it's been poor taste, but I think it's funny because I'm Asian. So, here's my shirt. It says, where are my dogs at? And it's in a Chinese takeout box. And I got this shirt from bustedtees.com. And actually, this is my husband's shirt, but I stole it from him. So yeah, and I rolled up the sleeves, so, you know, yeah. But yeah, isn't that so, <laughs> it's so funny. Okay. <laughs> So let me show you what I got from the thrift store. This is, a, this is from like two different um, visits. So I'll show you what I got last week. And um, I'll show you what I got today. So last week I found this awesome t-shirt and you're like, okay, it's just like a purple t-shirt, Jacqueline. Like really, it, it has a pocket, woohoo. But let me show you how, and it's by Ann Taylor Loft. Ooh, old people stuff. Whatever. It's really cool. What I like about it is that there's a seam right down the middle, the back. And it's super sheer. Like, see, you can see my face through it. So it's really cool. Like, it'll, you know, it's perfect for the summer. And, I, and what's really neat about it is that you can't tell, but look here. Ooh. <laughs> It's a chain, like this is chiffon, and encased in the chiffon is a chain to weigh the shirt down, so like to weigh the neck down. So it drapes really, like the bottom is really flowy and the neck like drapes and it just like drapes down on here and it's awesome. It's freaking awesome and I love it. <laughs> so, yeah. Then I found this awesome romper. I'm just really into this color right now. And it's made by Fire Los Angeles. Mm. 
And it looks like this. Ooh. It has these pockets right here. And what I love about it is that the metal wear is this gold, it's gold. So like it has like this gold zipper that goes all the way down past to the midsection. And like even like its um, strap pieces are like gold, brassy, you know, to match the zipper. And I really love that detail like on this kind of like teal turquoise type thing. And like you have the zipper right here. It just adds that little pop. So I love that. And rompers are so cute and they're so comfortable and yeah. <laughs> then I got this cargo skirt because you know I'm just lately I've just been really into like rompers and dresses and stuff. And even if you know me, you know that I am not a dress person, I'm not a romper person, but I think it's so cute and I keep on watching all these videos where people are like wearing these things and I'm like, that is so cute. Maybe I can totally rock that, so what better thing to do than go to the thrift store and talk, try it out for a couple bucks, you know, per item to see if it's going to work for me. But this is the skirt that I got. It has the side pocket. It has some back pockets. It's a gap skirt. It's just really casual, you know, maybe it's like throw on like a tank or like a, a white t-shirt and then this and you're good to go and you know since they're cargo you know you might not even need to bring your purse you know just your phone or whatever then today I got two two more dress oh two dresses and a shirt and let me show you the shirt first because I am in love with the shirt and it is so bombastical like I love it and I know I have so many shirts that are like the style and I was debating if I should get even another one because it's like one of those kind of like baby doll type things with the the tie in the back but I just couldn't resist you know and just let me just start off with the back first like BAM look at that like look at that first okay like how could you say no to that from the back side. From the back side, okay? And this is what it looks like. It's drapey, whatever. And then, boom! The front. Like, look at this ruffle detailing. And I, what caught me was like this like lace-like neckline. It is so gorgeous, you guys. So beautiful. And I just couldn't resist. And like, look at the price. Six, six fifty-six, And it's made by... Poetry clothing. I have no clue, but I just loved it so much, you know, so that's what that looks like Then I got um, I didn't even think about it, but when I saw it, I just I Looked through the dresses and I just wasn't really that interested and I said, you know what? You know, I started from one end and ended and you know and then you know to the other end I walked away and then where I ended, I started from there and I went, went to the beginning when I first looked at the dresses, if that makes sense. Just to give it a second go around. And I actually did find something in the second go around. And actually I found two dresses. First is this little mini dress. I call it mini, but it like totally works for me because I'm only 5'1". And again, it has like the, the brass, um, zipper thing that I totally love and I totally love this color too like this teal turquoisey color it has like this ruffle um like ruffle strappy things <laughs> ruffle straps and it is so cute on it is so cute and it is made by um Kimchi Blue, and if you guys know who Kimchi Blue is, they usually sell their stuff at Urban Outfitters. So I was really excited when I saw this, and it was like my size, and I only paid 
Again, $6.56 for this, when usually like a dress like this would cost at least $50. So I'm super excited to have it. It's super cute on. Really fun for the summer. And this also, like the romper, this is just, this is a dress, not a romper. But it also has pockets right here on both sides. So that's really cool. And then the piece, I always have like a piece that's like, the piece of like the month or something <laughs> with these thrift store finds and I was, just, I was just I love it so much and it was um first of all it's by I don't know if you're gonna see this cachet Lux, and it's this dress right here I don't think you're gonna be able to see it but let me just it's like um it goes to it goes to my knees, but again, but I'm short and petite, and it's really, it's like a bubbly dress, it kind of has no shape, so I probably will put a belt to it, but it has like these flowers right here, which I love, and it kind of looks like that, and I just, at first I just thought I was just going to try it on and see what it looked like, and it was so cute, and then I started looking up online, because I don't really shop at Cache. I always walk by it at the mall, but I'm just like, I don't think I can afford that. And I looked up their dresses, and I was like, what? And then when I looked up the Lux, uh, like, line, I was like, you've got to be kidding me. So, I was like, $12 is a little pricey for the thrift store, but it is so worth it, and it is so cute. So, this is like my find of, like, the month. And hopefully next week or so, I will be able to get a video up to show you what all these goodies look like in other, you know, thrift store finds that I have. Um, that's about it, you guys. If you have, if you have any questions, requests, um, suggestions on what I should do or um, anything, you, you guys know what to do. Comment below. Rate, comment, subscribe, like always. Subscribe somewhere up here, wherever, and um, again, every view, every subscription is always greatly appreciated. I thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully this isn't crooked because I kind of eyed my tripod because I'm filming in a different location, so it, it looks, honestly, it looks kind of slanted. <laughs> so thanks again so much for watching, and I will see you next time on another video.